I like to create context for the kind of questions I'm going to be getting this evening. Thank you very much. My name is Ehinome. I'm a cybersecurity consultant. And ever since I came here, I've learned a lot. I learned that one in seven persons are living with disability. That is about a billion of the world's population. I've also learned that 75% of women living with disabilities are unemployed. So we are dealing with an economic issue. We are dealing with a poverty issue. And to solve a poverty problem, what you need is the relevant skills. Poverty problem is not gender specific, it's not race specific, it's not cultural specific, it's the relevant skills. And thank God for the internet today, there's a huge opportunity for every one of us to take part of this economic movement that is going on. People living with disabilities, for example, somebody that has a condition called Asperger can learn and focus on a career like software development because they have the ability to intelligently focus and solve problems. So why can't we start thinking in this direction? We need a drastic cultural change. I was reading a story on The Guardian about Mackenzie, a woman with epilepsy. She got retrenched from her job because of her condition in 2015. Now in 2017, she sat home making $5,000 to $18,000 per month doing live stream of video games online. When I was a kid, they stopped me from playing video games. I wish I didn't listen to them. So she's making money there. There are so many opportunities online. There, there are sites like Fiverr.com. There are sites like uh, Upwork.com. You can do freelancing. And my position here is to come and give training, specific training that will change the lives of people. It's time to stop keeping up with the Kardashians. Let's keep up with technology. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, so the three focus today for me is uh, live stream your, your video game playing sessions. You make about $5,000 to $18,000. And. Have you heard of Udemy.com? Udemy. Have you bought any course there before? <laughs> In fact, a lot of people go to YouTube, but the problem with YouTube is that it's not, there's no guideline. There's no body accountable to tell the trainer that you're doing a terrible job. Improve your style of training. Now try to get them into technology. Okay. And science. If, if, I, if I meet a girl in an, in an event and she says, hello, I am a software developer. I code for this. I find books. You're like, wow. Very rare. Very rare. Very rare. You know, the visibility is good, especially with the kind of people you are targeting. The mayor is here. And the mayor is here. <laughs> Yeah. Two, two, yeah. three, three. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thanks for being here. Looking forward to connecting with you more. Learning Microsoft Word is like learning coding now. The way you, you, you learned Microsoft Word PowerPoint in 1995, 
that is how coding is that is how software development is that's what security analysis is that's what data science is so we need to step up the game challenge yourself change the culture stop keeping up with the kardashians it's time to start keeping up with technology because the tide is changing